Hey guys, today I'm going to cook and eat for the first time ever ginormous bluefin tuna eyeballs. But before we get into that, here's a quick background context on how I came across these things. A friend of mine asked me if I wanted a surprise ingredient, but wouldn't tell me what it was. This is what happened. Yo. <laughs> <laughs> what is it? What are you doing? It's a surprise. Seriously? Alright, so can I open it now or should I open it at home? Or? It would be fun if you open it on video, but if. You yeah, know. okay, you got me right now. <laughs> Let's do it. <laughs> is it gonna like jump out? Yeah, it smells like fish. Oh! <laughs> you <kidding> <laughs> <me>? <laughs> oh, you gave me the best part, hey? It's bluefin tuna, man. Is it bluefin? I was yeah. gonna say. Yeah. So it's like a delicacy then. Suck on it. <laughs> you gonna well, find a recipe? Yeah. Do it? Yeah, I gotta find a <laughs> So you guys ate all the good parts and you left me this shit in. <laughs> These things are huge. They feel slightly larger than a baseball. And it's very fleshy, uh, very fatty on the backside. Not gonna take any chances here, so I'm gonna rinse the eyeballs with boiled salt water. I'm going to prepare the eyeballs two different ways. The first dish we're going to make is using a very Japanese combination of soy sauce, ginger, and some sesame oil. I'm gonna start here by heating up about one tablespoon's worth of sesame oil. One tablespoon of minced ginger. Add the eyeball. After a couple of minutes here, I'm gonna add about two tablespoons worth of soy sauce. And after cooking that for a few minutes, it's basically all you gotta do. Now I'm just gonna garnish it here with some uh, fresh green onions. Does that look appetizing? I don't know. I don't know how appetizing an eyeball could look. All right, so um, you're supposed to eat it like bone marrow and like suck all the juices out. Oh my God, that doesn't look, can you see that inside? It's like gelatinous. What is that? <laughs> what is that? Can you even eat that? Is this, oh, oh no. <laughs> like, is that something you can eat? I'm gonna start with some of this. Oh, it's very fatty, very fatty. Okay, let's try some of the outside flesh here. Salty, um, very fatty, but that just tastes like tuna meat, if anything. That's not the weird stuff. This stuff in here is the weird stuff, like this. Okay, here we go, guys. Ready? Ready? Oh! This was the the lens on the eye. This is the best piece so far. <laughs> it's just mush. It's very gelatinous.
Let's try this. I don't know what this is, but that's what it looks like. It looks like jellyfish. Oh, can you see that? Okay, let's have a piece of this. I don't know what part of the eye this is, but It's just the fact that I know what it is or what part it's coming from, but if I don't think about it, it it's gelatin. It just tastes like gelatin. It's jello. Yeah, it's slimy jello, flavorless, tastes like a little bit of soy sauce. It's terrible. Let's not eat that. Okay, um, very fatty. See, it's basically fat around the edge. Just all this white fat, and fatty meat. Yeah, no. Nope. See you later. <laughs> Growing up in North America, these are just pretty foreign textures to me. Uh, not my thing, but hey, if you love it, good on you. I had a much better experience with the second dish. Click on that here if you want to see how I did it. Please also hit that like and subscribe button for more fun cooking and eating and food videos, guys. Alright, we'll take care until then.